What's up guys, YT Builds here, and today I'm going to be showing you a little mock that I made, and also a custom Flak 38 that my brother built. So here's the mock, um, it's just a tiny little mock just to show you the Flak 38. It's got four German soldiers, one of them looking out, uh, we got two riflemen on either side, one right there, and right there. And then we have kind of like a little foxhole with a German soldier on the Flak 38. And all along there's just tall grass. There's, um, this is actually an officer right here. And here's his MP40. And then there's the two riflemen. And as you can see, um, I camouflaged the Flak 38. So it's like full of vines and stuff, so the Americans don't see it. So yeah, I just made this tiny little mock just to show, um, just to give you a little view uh, of the Flak 38. So I'm going to show you what the Flak 38 looks like by itself, and I'll give you some history about it. So here's the Flak 38. Without all the vines on it, I'll give you some little detail about it. I'll get the mini fig off for you. So... Um, it's got a seat, and here's the little uh, sort of wheel to go, make it go up and down. Here's the periscope, so you can see what you're aiming at. There's the seating. Here's kind of like the handlebars, like to turn it and stuff, and to hold on. And then here's the front deflection shield with the actual barrel itself. Um, and then it's on kind of like a tripod. There's the base of it. And I'll give you a little history behind the gun. So the Flak 38, um, the Flak 38 were 20 millimeter anti-aircraft guns used by various German forces throughout World War II. It was not only the primary German light aircraft gun, but by far the most numerously produced German artillery piece throughout the war. It was produced in a variety of models, notably the Flak Verling 38, which combined four Flak 38 auto cannons on a one single carriage. And the Flak 38 shot 280 through 450 rounds per minute. So they would have these big clips um, of 20 millimeter rounds and they would shove them kind of like into the top um, and then it would just fire. It fired, it fired pretty fast. So here's the back of it. That's where everything's going on. It's got this little seat that can retract back. And there's kind of like the tray where you put the clip in. Here's, as I said, the wheel to move it up and down. And then here's the periscope. And there's just some other little features in there. Oh, and also the cannon. It can move up and down. I'll show you that. It can go up and down because it's an anti-aircraft gun, so it has to point up and shoot down U.S. aircrafts. So it was a German gun. I think that's all for today. Leave a like on the video and subscribe, and until next time, goodbye.